Okay, so I had a real world situation happen to me last night into this morning. I've been doing really, really well with my own training and my mindset and my work, stuff like that, over the last kind of three months. Some of that's down to creating new healthier habits for myself personally. I'm a business owner. I understand the stresses and the strains and the time constrictions that come with that. We've also got two little kids, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Excuses, excuses, excuses but I had found myself slipping off my training a little bit and not being as on point as I should have done. So I fixed that, started to get myself into a daily habit of getting up in the morning, going to the gym. But what happened last night was my wife had a really, really bad night of sleep. Couldn't go to bed till two, three in the morning. Was up again at six. I felt really bad. I hadn't had a great sleep either. So I woke up this morning, woke up at six anyway, because I need to have that routine in my life. Otherwise it throws everything out got up, sat down the stairs on the computer on the dining table, got a couple of hours work done or an hour and a half's work done between when my kids got up, I made sure those was okay, made sure she was okay, helped out as best I could, and then the kids all went off to school. The problem was is that my day had then started with calls and meetings, etc. so the training couldn't really happen. Now what happened in my brain and what, happened, what will happen in your brain when this happens to you, and it will happen, things happen, shit happens in your life, and you'll miss a workout or you'll grab the wrong choice, whatever it may be. I know in my head from doing this for a very long time, you need to get back into the pattern ASAP. Generally speaking, you can get away with one day if you're in a good flow. Two days, you've officially broken the cycle then effectively. It's really important you get back on the wagon. So what I did was I thought, right, I've got a 20 minute home workout, which is on the Truth Accountability Plus app. It's kind of all home based, it's floor based, um, it's real low intensity. 20 minutes, I thought I know what I can do. I'll come back before I pick my son up, I'll nick that 20 minutes and get that workout done. Now, your situation may be different to mine. It might mean that you have to do it after work of 20 minutes. It might mean that you have to walk back from the station just to get some activity in your diary if you've missed that workout in the morning because something happened. It's just important you do something. So I've got back on into the habit of reinstated the kind of pattern of making it happen. I feel good about myself. I'm happy because I've got that pattern, that kind of structure back, which as we get older, it's definitely something that we need to have in our lives. The chaos doesn't really serve us very much. And number five, I'm getting the benefit of getting into that training session. I've done it, I've burned some calories, my mindset's back in place, and now I'm gonna make better choices throughout the evening and into tomorrow. So, if what I've said resonates with you, if you're someone that breaks the pattern quite often, just give yourself a little bit of a break. Rather than forcing yourself or making yourself feel bad about not doing what you should have done, do a tailored back version of what you should have done. A 20 minute workout, half an hour walk, whatever it may be. If you're really watching this video and you'd love to kind of see that home workout that I create, or me and my team created on the Truth Accountability Plus app, comment below or DM me, you're very welcome. And we'll set you up on the app and you can have the workout for free. It won't cost you a penny. Anyway, there's also free training below this video as well, which I'll stick at the top of the comments. It's the five, uh, five steps to rapid weight loss and it's been filmed with me and my head coach, Craig Simon. So really interesting, great bit of information in there. The kids are in the bath, starting to scream, so I better get back to them.